Well, Arsene Wenger, who's still pushing his plans for a World Cup every two years. UEFA have already rejected the proposed changes. But Wenger, who is FIFA's global head of football development, believes if people can alter their perception of the current football calendar, it will be beneficial for all involved. I believe that uh, the players want to play big games. What they don't want is to play small games, you know. And the big competitions... Uh, is something that everybody wants to play. You know? If I tell you now you will be world champion, if, even if it's for 10 minutes, you will say yes. And uh, giving more opportunities. In, today, if a country doesn't go to the World Cup, they have to wait for eight years. If a player is injured, he doesn't play for eight years the World Cup. So I just believe it's a, a, a reshaping of your mind because it's unusual. But as well, the perception of time has changed and the younger generation uh, wants to be entertained much more. Well, Arsene Wenger is adamant that it's not about financial gain, but instead it suggests a World Cup every two years will help develop the game on a global scale. I can understand that uh, people uh, have a little emotional uh, uh, back, you know, and that they are scared that uh, uh, it is too big a change. But uh, nothing to do with money. It's just based on... Uh, uh, having more meaningful competitions, giving more chances to countries who have never the opportunity to go to the World Cup, improve uh, the quality of the game all over the world. It's just a part of that because when you have more chances to, to learn from uh, top level teams and uh, give a, a better organization of making football more modern.